Hello Libra. This is your reading for the 4th through the 5th. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. <clears throat> this is a general reading, so it will not resonate for everyone, okay guys? If you're new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe, guys. Let's see what we've got for my Libras today. Moving on. Moving on after feeling very hurt, um, very disappointed in something here. Moving on by yourself, okay? Um... You know, not really feeling that good about it, but feeling like it's something that has to be done here. Aquarius energy. Maybe an Aquarius you guys are dealing with. Let's see. The High Priestess. Mm. There, there's a lot that you're trying to figure out. Um, I feel like somebody really wants to, to keep you guys um, from moving on. They're not saying it, though. They're not, they're not telling you, you know, exactly how they feel. They're hiding a lot here, okay? The Queen of Swords. And I think you know this. I think you know this. I think you're using your intuition um, in deciding to move on. Like, you know, it's best for you. There, there's a lot that I feel like um, you don't know about this person. There's a lot of um, mysteriousness surrounding them. They don't speak a whole lot. <clears throat> and I feel like that's what you're cutting out. There's a, there's a lot that's like not clear um, with this individual. And you just want to cut it out. But I see you kind of going back and forth with this, my Libra friends. I see you going back and forth with this. Okay. Thinking about this a, a lot thinking about it a lot and I think a lot of you are thinking um, you know if this is indeed the right thing for you to do you know to leave this behind or or whether to tell this person exactly you know what it is that you're feeling tell them a piece of your mind because they're not saying a whole lot here um, and I think it's got you you know it's, it's bothering you here okay ace of swords yeah hmm I think you just want them to be honest, um, open and honest here, because otherwise it's like, you know, you're mapping your next steps out. It's like deuces, I'm out, because you can't deal with a lot of the the unknown um, behaviors, the unknown, um, you know, circumstances here. The, the communication is very almost non-existent. So there's not there's not a lot that you guys really know um, about this individual, this situation, and so it's just it's easier, and um, you feel like it's in your best interest just to like you know leave it alone, leave it alone here. Um, breaking up with people, I feel like um, there's somebody here. I feel that um, you guys have definitely cut out. And I don't think they're happy about it here with the tower. I think this probably has rocked their world, this person, Scorpio energy here. Hmm. But the foundation was not there for, um, you know, for it to stand and to endure the world there. You know, like I said, you're kind of going back and forth with this because um, you have the world here, which is an ending. You have the tower here, which is an ending. But it's like you you know in your heart that you want to move on, but yet still you're you're kind of you know still present in the situation, still thinking about it. Um, you know, wanting to know the truth when instinctively, intuitively, you do know the truth about this person. Um, I think that you would just like to hear them come clean, but um, they're not, is what I'm getting right here. So it's like you're still present in this situation, even though, you know, this is trying to wrap itself up. It's trying to wrap itself up so you can start a new cycle here and be done with whatever nonsense that you have dealt with before, whether it's with this person or with, you know, past situations, relationships here, um, being done with that type of behavior and going into a new cycle with, you know, new expectations and 
you know, new behaviors, accepting only things that, you know, benefit you and, um, you know, that you deserve here. Okay. Because you don't have to, you don't have to, you know, ask or know here at this person's mouth, you know, what, what it really is. Because with the high priestess and the ace of swords, you, you know, already, you know what you need to do. Okay. Let's see what else we've got here. We've got the Nine of Cups. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I feel like you guys, you know, you're somebody's wish. But I feel like you have kind of cracked that whip on them. Um, and they're feeling kind of brokenhearted right now. They're feeling really torn down. Um, but, you know, your ultimate goal is not to hurt anyone. You just want to be happy yourself. You just want to be happy yourself, but somebody does not want to let go of this. And I don't think it's you. I think you just want to see the truth in this situation. Okay. Five of Cups there. Yeah, somebody's feeling very sad, very regretful here. Like they've wasted their time. Um, maybe that they'll never find love again. They'll never have a love like this one. Somebody here, whether it's you or the other person, is feeling really kind of like, um, you know, like all is lost. While the other one is, is, is feeling happy. But I feel like neither one of you is truly happy, honestly. I feel like um, y you are way more happy than they are is what I'm getting from this but you're not truly happy because this is not the way you wanted things to work out okay the page of cuts but you're 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 ready to go on it's like you know you're on this you're on this venture to you know find things that that vibe with you you're not trying to give too much you're not trying to give too little but you know you, you're just like you're mapping your steps you're mapping your steps because there again, you don't want to work on something that really does not have any um, solid foundation to grow, you know, and prosper and be healthy for you. So you're just wanting to be happy. <clears throat> and um, that is what you are on a quest to do here. So we have Scorpio energy here, Pisces. Um, let's see, Gemini energy. I feel like this is all you though. And um, any other air sign, Aquarius and uh, Libra like yourself. But I feel strong um, Scorpio energy, um, Piscean energy here, Aquarius is here. Alright guys, so that's what I have for you and I will be speaking with you soon.